Henry White with Spotlighting Paradise here with John Lewis of Lewis Communications and Pop, a local entrepreneur, music producer from Senegal. And uh, together they're representing Equal Rocks, a wonderful organization that is putting together a uh, holiday gala here in Northampton and benefit concert. And I'll start with you, John. What is Equal Rocks and what, what does it, what is it about? Well, Equal Rocks uh, stands for um, kind of Equality Rocks. Um, the whole vision behind this initially was we were planning on doing the World Music Festival, as you know, in Absolutely. the fall, Equinox, and it was more about celebration of art and culture. Um, falling on the Fall Equinox Day, which is, you know, equally day and light, which, you know, most of it we wanted to do is really push this whole idea and concept of, you know, uh, equality, justice, mm -hmm. you know, empowerment and community development, not only here locally, but also abroad because Pop lives in Axel, Senegal, so, wow. uh, who's my partner here of uh, uh, Ancient Meets Urban. So we kind of joined together uh, with a shared love and vision for not only music, but also the ability to be able uh, to provoke and create substantive change in underserved and needed communities. Right, so you, you're looking to, to actually do some developing of, of positive programs and and other um, initiatives in the community here. Yeah, we're definitely, and we already partnered with two individuals that kind of represent that, which is the reason why we're throwing the gala and we're going to be funding those initiatives. One is Friends of Children, who really work with adopted uh, children and building communities around them. And then also what is called the Senegal American Project, who does arts and education within um, Senegal, uh, which Pop and uh, Tony Vaca helped start uh, partnering along with uh, Jean. And now we're trying to really expand that vision. And that vision is, is how can we continue to raise money and build awareness, uh, but doing it in a very fun and kind of exciting way. Right. And introducing people to culture, getting them to know each other, and then also having them, you know, be involved in supporting benefits and funding uh, community development uh, initiatives that our foundation is uh, going to be doing, which is another reason why we're doing the galas, because we're launching our actual foundation that particular weekend. Great. Now, speaking of Tony Vaca, I mean, you guys have some amazing headline and some, mm. some amazing acts. Mm. Pape, talk to us about, uh, and folks out there, you've seen uh, at, in the opening, uh, Nimbaya, a very powerful uh, women's group. Uh, women's Drum Corps. Mm -hmm. uh, so tell us about your, your acts that you're bringing in here. Yeah, um, for this benefit concert, uh, we're bringing, uh, the, it, uh, we have headli as a headliner, we're gonna have Nimbaya. Yeah. It's an all-female uh, woman drum and dancers from Guinea, West Africa. And there are 14 of them. I don't, you know, I've been in the music for, it's about 15, 17 years now, doing this uh, music production but never in my life seen like any band that is 14 piece and right. all women and drum and dancers. So we're gonna have a Nimbaya uh, coming for the first time in Western Massachusetts. And also we're gonna have a Keisha, Keisha who's a Keisha. soul singer from Cameroon, uh, south, uh, around the South Africa. And also we're gonna have a jazz artist, Paul Lieberman, uh, who's uh, from Brazil, wow. but lives around here. And we're also going to have uh, Tony Vaca in the Impulse Ensemble. Wow, so, so it's, you got a it's, mixture. It's kind of like a, uh, a festival. It's Absolutely. not just like a concert. But we're trying to bring um, uh, the world together in this type of uh, benefit concert we're trying to do. That's why we even call it uh, our children's world. Because this uh, benefit concert will be helping uh, people from uh, children here and children overseas, right. because part of the profit will go to uh, the Senegal American Project, which will be helping lots of kids back home where I live in Africa. Right. And some of, some of the uh, profit will go to the friend of children who does a lot of great activities here in, in, Not in Northampton and right. Western Massachusetts. So basically, like John just said, uh, we, uh, we're doing this, uh, this is gonna be uh, our kickoff uh, uh, for this, a lot of stuff we're going to be doing in the future. Because mm. if, uh, inshallah, if everything goes right, we'll be, you know, doing a, a bigger festival in the summer. That's right. So that's, yeah. that's the whole idea. Well, great. And I see that happening. Uh, so, and I, you guys have been working on this for, for a good while now. I've yeah. been running, every time <laughs> I run into John, which, which is quite often, uh, we, we're always talking about, and he's always talking about, 
this and you guys come a long way. You got some great sponsors. You want to just talk about some of the sponsors that you have? Yeah, we would definitely like to thank our sponsors and thank all the people who are helping us putting this together, which is like really important. I mean, they've worked, you know, really hard and really diligently to mm -hmm. do it. So our no, Leah, Leah, Leah Toyota. Leah uh, Toyota. Uh, so we want to okay. thank Leah Toyota for sure, who's a sponsor. Mm -hmm. um, all the media sponsors, which is uh, WRSI, mm -hmm. WEIB, um, uh, Mix 93, uh, Kari Angiri is also going to be hosting oh, great. Uh, the event. Um, and now NCTV. And also the Valley Advocate, uh, NCTV. Uh, mm -hmm. And are there any other sponsors that we forgot about? Yeah, we have a lot of people supporting this. Absolutely. And, and, and one of those I will call, I will just say, Ann, uh, Ann Walsh. Who've been helping connected us marketing. connecting right, marketing? Okay. Who've been helping a lot, doing a lots of wonderful work in this project, and we also have uh, alongside uh, Carrie and Jury, we're gonna have a band from the WEIB oh, yeah. who will be uh, hosting the event too. Oh wow, like a house so, band? Uh, ben, he's a radio uh, DJ. He's oh, a radio, okay, yeah. right, the radio DJ. He's a radio yeah, DJ from okay. WEIB. WEIB, right. Yeah, the so mm -hmm. yeah, and also uh, yeah, we have a lot of people. Monte from. Uh, uh, the river mm -hmm. so you know he's been helping us uh, since the beginning so yeah we have lots of people we have a whole team it's you know behind you know helping this project right you know, we like some one of them is tony vaca is not just performing but right he's helping he's a lot he's part of the team right and we have gene and we have jane jane, the fr Lyons, uh, jane lyon children. friend of children who Absolutely. also you know been a big part of this project right it's yeah. a great, it's, it's going to be a great event, and uh, you guys have been doing a wonderful job uh, putting it together and uh, getting it out to the community. So, it's going to be at the Academy of Music. Academy of Music. Academy of Music. December 15th, right in the spirit, in the time of the holiday. Absolutely. Uh, if you want more information about it, you can go to uh, equalrock.com. Uh, mm -hmm. And you can also... Uh, uh, like you guys know, this is the hardest ticket in town, you know, mm -hmm. and, and this is, this, you know, this, we already selling a lot of tickets already. So we want people to support this, you right. know, to be a success. So if, uh, if you can go to, you can get the tickets by going to the Academy of Music. Academy of Music. Or you can com. go to the Academy of Music Theater dot com. Right. Or you can go to in person and get, get a ticket. Well, thank you. And uh, we appreciate you guys stopping by here. We look forward to... Uh, the concert there it's going to be a great time and i would encourage you folks out there to support this great event and uh happy holidays